But if we're looking into this one again, guys, we can see that we have a, a chain rule. You could say that we have, um, so we're trying to find d over dx. We could basically say d over dx of the square root of u. So therefore, if we say u is going to be xy, and we want to find du over dx, then we need to obviously, so you're basically saying, all right, I'm doing the chain rule. I have an outside function of an inside function. Uh, outside function, inside function. So here's my inside function, x, y. So du d over dx. Again, it's the exact same as doing um, as when we did the product rule in the last problem. So you're going to have y plus x dy over dx. And then obviously we know that the uh, derivative in this is going to be, so it'll just be equal to 1 over 2 square root of u times the derivative du d over dx. Now what we're basically going to do is take my xy and plug it back in. So it's 1 over 2 times the square root of xy times the derivative of my du dx. So du dx is right there, which is y plus x dy over dx. And then that's it.